Start recording. Right. Okay, hey everybody, Daniel and I are going to show you how to play uh, Shinigami. Um, we each have five different target cards, and we each have five different ability cards. We have the five event cards in the middle, and they're all shuffled up. Um, I have the boss avatar, and he has the first lieutenant avatar in front of him. Um, so uh, each turn, um, we're get, we're gonna play through two rounds. Normally, you'll play play five rounds. Um, so uh, first turn, we put our two units in the middle, like an ante and poker, and then we choose our target. Okay. Okay. Um, so I'm the boss, so I go first. I reveal my target. Uh, I targeted myself, and I use the first lieutenant to block one ability against your target. Um, then Daniel goes next, revealing his target. Okay. I targeted you, and I did stage. So, uh, target pays you two units. If your target has not used their ability, they secretly switch their own target. Um, so, since I'm going first, I won't have to switch my target, but I will have to pay him two units. Um, but before any of that happen, well, before any of that happens, we uh, flip the event card, and this is uh, no abilities can be blocked. So, actually, um, I wouldn't have had to pay him two units because I was blocking his card, but nothing can be blocked, um, and so I do pay him two units. Um, and since my uh, ability went off first, I don't switch my target. Okay, um, I'm going to discard my ability because you can only use uh, abilities once per round, but the target card can go back in my hand. <clears throat> Go ahead and pay these. Yep, so each pay. Um, so since I went first uh, last turn, he goes first now, revealing his uh, target and ability. Yep. Targeted you. Okay. And I want five. Okay. Um, I targeted him, and I also want five. So we're going to uh, flip the um, event card. That is, players do not die. Um, so since uh, neither of us are trying to kill each other we just have to each pay five units so we would exchange five units keeping us where we're at okay uh, this ability gets discarded and I take my tar car target card back Um, we make sure to pay our two units. That's right. Okay, and uh, it's my turn to go first. So I um, reveal that I targeted uh, Daniel, the first lieutenant, and with the snitch. And I targeted myself and blocked. And blocked. Okay. okay. Um, so what will happen is. Uh, we flip the event card, and the event goes first, and it says, All players who played the boss ability this turn die. Um, neither of us played the boss ability, so neither of us die. 
Um, I go first. So uh, Daniel pays me two units, and if my target has not used their ability yet, they secretly switch their own target. Um, so Daniel must switch his target and pay me two units. Um, so just so we could see what would happen is um, Daniel's going to change his target from himself to me. And um, he's going to block me. Um, but basically nothing happens after that. Um, so I'll go ahead and discard my card. And take my target. So as we can see, we both are down to only two, um, two abilities. Uh, so I'm going to choose my target. Pay two. Oh, pay two. Yep, always pay two. So we have quite a few coins uh, in in the middle. There's 16 units. Okay. Um, I went first last time, so Daniel goes first this time. Okay. I'm going to target you, and I want the money, so I'm killing you. Okay. Um, I also targeted Daniel, and I also want to kill him. <laughs> um, so we're going to flip this event card, and it is first player to play the snitch ability dies. Uh, neither of us are playing it. Um, so Daniel goes first, and he kills me, actually. Um, and so, since I'm dead, my ability cannot go off. Um, so I die first, basically. Um, so that means that Daniel collects the 16 units in the middle, and that round is over. Um, so once the round is over, we put all the events back and shuffle them up, and then we draw, uh, or take all our abilities back so we can use them in the new round, and then we'd start the next round. Um, okay. Thanks for watching.